You know, it's December now, so families always talk about traditions this time of year. Well, the McDevitt football team family's tradition over the past few seasons has been going to the state championship game, a place they'd like to return to with a win here tonight against Dallas. You can see it's not exactly the perfect weather conditions out, so you know it's going to be a ground and pound game, and that would be huge. That's just what Bishop McDevitt does to start the game. Nazir Jones Davis, just a sophomore, breaks off a pair of first down runs, eventually moving into Dallas territory. And a few plays later, the Crusaders are knocking on the door. Jones Davis is going to finish it off by plowing through the line for six. McDevitt leads seven nothing. That's how this one would stand for most of the first half. A big reason why the Crusaders defense, Nick's logic and Lucas Lawler creating some havoc in the backfield as Dallas's offense continues to struggle to get going. But towards the end of the second quarter, the Mountaineers are going to get some bounces, literally. A blocked punt turns into a bit of a fumble rumble, which turns into a scoop six for Dallas. Then an onside kick bounces off a Crusader and sets up Dallas for a third and long touchdown pass as the Mountaineers take a 13-7 lead into the half. In the third, Crusaders offense shows a spark. Fourth down on the 20. Stone Saunders puts a dime up to Rico Scott, who comes down with it. The PAT was blocked, so it's tied at 13. Team. Both teams are able to tack on field goals, and we are heading to overtime. Dallas gets the touchdown early, so Bishop McDevitt needs one. Saunders going out to Jones Davis. Watch the effort here. He will not be brought down, swerving his way into the end zone. We are going to double OT. McDevitt can't punch it in. They line up for the field goal. Dallas blocks it. It's their third block of the night. The Mountaineers only need a field goal to win it. The kick is true. Bishop McDevitt's title win comes to a close 26-23 in double overtime. Block punch. For a touchdown, you know, two onside kicks, they recover. You know, block PATs. Um, if you do that, you're going to lose. And, and they're a good team, and you know, it's a shame. Uh, you know, we talked about all year. It's hard to repeat. From here, we're going to send it over to Evan 